You get your dang seatbelt on. Fuck what? Because there's, there's you road don't checks. Trust me? No, no, there's road checks right now. I know, because they told me where they're at. Well, hell, I'll call Randy and see where the fuck they're at. Do whatever you want to do, but you put your seatbelt on because I don't want you getting in trouble. Alright, Jesus Christ. Fucking rules. Ooh, that could have been bad. I might have spilt that some bitch about four times in the golf cart. You're good, Dad. Just trying to make sure we get home safe. Where's uh? Where's where's no show staying? Longhorn? No show. Longhorn? Yeah, that's his new nickname for tonight. He went back to St. Louis. He went all the way back to St. Louis tonight? Me. He's got something important tomorrow. Really? What he said? No oh, shit. I ain't gonna touch him. You're kidding me. Nope. At least I think that's what he said. I, dude, I was trying to find his little metal thing to hear, like... And Cody found one for me, so I was alright. Came all the way up here for two hours? No, he's up here for about four hours. Oh, alright, four hours. Well, he made some good connections. And that's it? I think in October. I think in October, like a fucking badass. He had a room for tonight. He might. I don't know. I not, was not in charge of him this time. <clears throat> he was not my responsibility. Do you actually realize how many six or seven trips I got to make up here tomorrow? Um, now, there. no. All honesty aside. Yeah, I can see you going, oh, I'll help well, you out. Yeah, a couple times. No, yeah. actually, there's a couple people. So gonna, I'm I, gonna, got, I got a guy taking one of your trailers along with the truck. That's one truck. I'm going to, if I bring my truck up, that can, but then you get yours and you put Tahoe, but then we can well, probably get one Well, if I can get a ride back up here. We don't even need to do that. We can probably get Jared or somebody to take one of the cars, the car, and follow all the way back. In other words, we can oh, probably HQ? Do yeah. Well, I can okay. get Dad back to go. Yeah, that's, that's, that's the thing done. done. And if I can get my boat, get back up there and get my boat home. Right, plus we have a truck that's taking the... Uh, Shit, I can get back up there and uh, get One my, trip, we can do it all. Uh, no. I got two big trucks to drive home. Oh, uh, that's right. The big trucks are going to have two that. CDL. I don't have a CDL. Yeah, so I got to... But, hey, it's better gotta, than... We can... Okay, three trips. Yeah. There's three trips right there alone just getting the trucks back. But it's a 15-minute drive. It's not that big of a deal. The red one only goes 45 miles an hour. So does my truck. <laughs> well, yeah, so you know what I mean. The red one only goes 45 miles an hour. I know. I got to get that one back, go back up and get the, the old cab yeah. over. I got to get that one back. Once I get both them trucks back, it's gravy. I don't give a shit. We've been invited to ports tonight. Ports are already closed, man. Everything's closed. We're already past time on everything. No, oh, no. Ports is open until 3 30 in the morning. It's 12 30. We've been Dude, invited. I gotta be here at 7 o'clock in the that morning. That guy standing next to my golf cart with his skinny little girlfriend that invited us down there to ports tonight. Sweetheart, can you hear me? Say hi to my friend Terry. Yep. Hello. Hi, Dad. Terry, this is Jansen. Jansen, this is Terry. 
It's really hard to hear you. That's what we're doing. Don't get confused with my name. What? what? No, I'm free. Yeah, are you on Skype? I'm waking her up too late. Are you on Skype? Alright, I'm gonna go to Skype, okay? Um, no. No? Yeah. Yeah. I was gonna talk to you on Skype and introduce you to Terry. It's alright. You don't need no Terry. Uh, maybe I can You're in bed? Alright. I'll give you a call back in a little bit, sweetheart. Let me get back in the Quincy and I'll give you a call back. No, I, what? No, what? I can change, I can change clothes, I can talk to you. Alright, change clothes and I'll call you on Skype, okay? okay. okay. Alright, sweetheart, I'll talk to you in a bit. Bye. On Skype. Face to face talking. Oh. You can see her on there. Instead of just talking on a phone, you're gonna That's a little you. new thing I got on my text deal with my son. Uh, yeah, let me show you. Is that what this is? It has a big S on it. I don't know. This no, is, that's uh, him. That's something else. Uh, my son. Where's he at? Good. He's got this uh, view talk. Yeah, that's another one of those. Is that something new with Sprint? No, you can, it's, those, these are to applications. Where, these are applications. All right, but. Drive, <laughs> man. Yeah, yeah, blame my driving there. Hey, no, it's called View Talk. I know what it is. It's, it's like Skype. And I can push that and call it and we can see each other. Yeah. Uh, you know what, you're, that's what she's with. Skype's the since, one that's older, but it's got a better reception. Since I'm paying his cell phone bill, so. Trust me, you know, usually the only thing you want to look at is women, so. Alright, I got somebody following me. I'm going to follow him very close. This is Skype. Oh, you're going to pass me? Really? Please Sam Blasting. Oh, I am. I ain't gonna get a freaking ticket. Maybe when the cop thinks right down here, he doesn't know it. Chuck a heater on it. For speeding, but not a DUI. You're not going to get it on this road. I'm not going to get a DUI. I'm not going. No, the county's going to hang out just outside of town, like an Iron House Road. There, you know what? Randy told me, he said, we don't need fucking do DUI check sites anymore. It's not worth our fucking problems. The city and the fucking state does it all. The county doesn't do anything like that. This is good. Yeah, we, okay. No, nah, Randy, Randy said, we focus on fucking meth labs and shit like that. That's what we go after. Yeah, you know how many freaking state cops are around here? Oh, no, they're state cops they're because the city, fucking the city pays them. The city pays they the state quite well. Instead, yeah. The city pays the state quite well to, to do their uh, city observation. Why? Because it ties it ties up the city police less and the county police. They don't even do fucking roadblocks. Randy, I always ask Randy, so where's city fucking roadblocks? Is there fuck Terry? Says they don't even tell me. They're because aunt. they're all under the state police. You know what's kind of messed up? During my aunt's funeral, you know, 
they had a fucking seatbelt check. Now they didn't do it for the actual funeral. Let us go through, but they were doing a seatbelt check next to the cemetery. How stupid can you get? Yeah. And you know what? They didn't catch anybody. People are not that dumb anymore. People are dumb. Don't get me wrong. Just not that dumb. Tonight? No, no, they were playing them earlier today. Maybe, no, no, they were playing them yesterday. I think they might be playing them yesterday. God, I'm, my days are getting crushed at each other. I'm trying to salvage a fucking date out tonight. I wanted that freaking one with the white shirt on with the tattoos. I kept Daytona. trying Daytona. Yeah. Daytona. I was Could trying I to friend. work on you with her. I was with Karen. Daytona was her friend. I tell you what, she had some fucking nipples that were the size of fucking quarters. I know, she had rings in them, both of them. Woo! Those are nice. Did I you not get my text Karen. saying, hey, you know, get these girls, man? Well, I had them. Dave wanted And me. then you guys... No, Dave had me. You go. lost them all. You disappeared. No, The I girls didn't. decided to go up to the stage. Dave? I'm sitting there in the car, and guess who sits next to me? Longhorn. Hi, right, brother. How Dave, you doing? Dave had nobody to relate to. I'll tell you what. You call me Puddin. I'll call you Puddin. And you call me Vanilla. Dave's father had nobody to relate to. I had a group. No, it's cool. I've been talking to her, but I can't get a response out of her. Which one? Daytona? Karen. But Tell Daytona Karen. was her friend. Tell, hey, my so friend Jeff like Daytona. You can't get to one without the other. I know that. That's why I told you. <laughs> I told her I Did said... I not send you a text I told that. her I said I wasn't a very good friend tonight, was I? And I said, can we go to a movie tomorrow or something after I'm done bringing all those trucks home? Tell and her I'm right waiting for a response. Tell her right with you in the trucks. Well, would you like, after we get all the trucks and shit home, you want to you you go to a movie? Oh, right here. Do you want to go to the movie and you bring Daytona and I'll take a movie and I'll go with Karen? And we'll get it like a double feature there and everybody's happy. <laughs> no, seriously, I'm working. I go, I I'm Sorry, working on it. I don't got my daughter. Don't you sleep. oversleep tomorrow? No, I'm not going to oversleep. Don't call me before 9 o'clock. I was going to say, yeah, I was going to say, I ain't calling you at 7 because believe me, I no. said be up there at 7. No, I'm going to be up there at no, I was really see, good. I went to bed at 8 see, o'clock last I'm night. What the problem is... Why don't you come inside tonight? Why don't no, you stick I, I really do gotta get home. I gotta get some sleep. Like, I would because what? I would because I am free. Yeah, but I'm me. drunk. I know you are, and it's meet time. It's like, man, I just can't. But I don't get many people in my house. <laughs> You're you know, my friend. I'm not really sick. And I'll come over. And I'm gonna give you all a fucking pocket knife so you can no, call your fucking don't. name in them. I want nothing. Henry, you are my saying friend. I was here. <laughs> You know, really, seriously. I know I need you're to, I need to give the that to Longhorn. Years, I know you're I need to give it to Longhorn. I actually got it. I, I, comedy need, act. I need to get some The sleep. friends don't come uh, over to my house. That's what I'm asking. I live in the last one. Okay. Well, I, I don't have friends Poor come to my house. house. And when they do come over, I have them carve the name into my uh, I'll I'll have to go I am the Just so that I know they were there. Dude, I had to take care of Dave's ego tonight and everything else. You know what? I didn't get no shit from Dave tonight. No, you didn't. You know why? Because I take I care of I gave him a hat. No, Dave's a good guy. I gave him a hat. Just not. Boy, this looks really naked. Yeah. I absolutely have no car, no boat. Get I got a boat cover. Make sure you got your keys on you, right? Uh, shit, I'm in your pocket. Well, I, didn't like, I got extra keys in the shit. I know. Make sure you got them on you, though. No, make sure you get them I don't. I left them in the no. truck. Well, the, <laughs> no, no, the car keys are up there. I want your, your truck keys to be in your pocket. No. Did you leave those up there, too? You're right. I do have my truck keys. It's got to have somebody looking out, buddy. If we don't, then we don't get back home safe. My friend, go home. Go inside that house. Go Lay home. down. <laughs> Dude, I'm home. Lay down. You need to sober up. 
Really? Mister, I don't even know where the door is at. <laughs> My stereo sounded really hey, good inside uh, that building. Am Amcor, what's his name? Your your partner, fishing partner, what's his name? Bruce. No. Your fishing partner. Brent. Brent. We should have called him and harassed him for not being there tonight. <laughs> uh, grand, grandkids. Uh, he just got his second. They all got to go to bed at a certain time. He just got his second grandchild like three months ago. Now yeah, I cool. came into town from Peoria. That's cool. Couldn't I, know ask, that I couldn't ask him. Yeah. But you know what I did ask him? What's that? I said, can I borrow your trailer? <laughs> he let me go out and get his trailer and load the lawnmower. He just got to cut all that. Take the lawnmower off of it. You can use it. I, I checked it tonight. So, it was fine. Nobody touched it anyway. I don't even know if it's still up there. It's got like 20, I checked 20 it. gallons of fuel. No, I checked it. Everything's fine. Yeah. Nobody touched it. No. Uh, Nobody showed up the damn event. How could he ever touch it? <laughs> Dick Dicker would have loved to be there, but he had his, his one of them weekends. You know, if you we know, do this. Three-day weekend. He goes, I got grandkids coming in. I think we should do it next year, but we got to plan the proper weekend. Because this is one of those things you do one time. So next year, 4th of July, final No, no, Saturday. no, no. No, not the 4th of July. Just say we got to plan something in the summertime in a proper week where nothing else is going on. Don't it doesn't have to be 4th of July weekend. No. No. I mean, it's patriotic. It's cool. But you know what? We got fucked by it. Well, we take got... Glenn said he came up there had a couple beers, but you know, he left early. The Glenn was there from the time I got there a little after 2 and he was there till the He was up there for the kitty rides. For the opening ceremonies, uh, the flag thing. And that sounded that. like an idiot during the opening ceremonies. You know what? That was, uh, no, you actually did good on the prayer. I did it from the you heart. You did. You did. Hey, my hat's off for you. You, you did good on the prayer. And when Glenn, we were all there. Glenn left. It was probably 7 o'clock when Glenn left. 6 or 7, right in that neighborhood. All right, but you also have to realize something. Man, Glenn's got a full house. And he was there. He did what he wanted to do. Uh -huh. He got it done. He showed up. Think about it. Everything's coming he together. Is, his wife's out of town this weekend. He has a free weekend. Look at it like this. Let him go. Everything, whether you like it or not, hey, is Rich coming Green together. Hey, side with Natalie. Everything's I'm coming together like Legos. date Natalie. I am trying to date her. And just to take her to lunch. You mean my ex? No, Natalie on uh, well. W. Yeah. No, that's not your ex. Yeah. You're serious? Yeah. That's her? Well, no, 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 no. That's not my your, daughter's your mother. Daughter's no, 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 no. Me and Natalie, before I went in the Marine Corps. Oh. And she's been a really good friend of mine. She's a sweetheart. She's not your ex. We dated. What? We dated. I never slept with her. All right, she dated. Well, I, I, mean, I never slept with her. All right, I think she's really cute, and I just wanted. To no, she's a her. she's a sweetheart. She really is. Uh, she always anyway, I talking to Rich King tonight, and I told him I said, "Hey, you know, he always got to go around in the bush and said, not who you know, it's what you or not what you know, it's who you know." And I said, "You know, I, all I wanted to do was just go to. She works with my son at the country club every Thursday night. And my son lives, works there full time." I said, you know what? I've been on Facebook. She talked to me for a little while, and then she just disappeared. I said, all I want to do is take her for lunch. I That's said, Natalie hey, for Rich, you. I said, just tell her, hey, Terry, he just wants to take you to lunch. He's just going to take you to McDonald's. <laughs> no, really, seriously, McDonald's is fine. Get those girls that go uh, out with us tomorrow night. Rich said, he says, you know, he says, I uh, talked to her here a while back, and I gave her some shit going, why the fuck aren't you married? You're old enough that you're at the stage of your life. You ought to be married. That could be do something with me. No, but... Yeah. Uh, anyway, dude, nothing to rain on your parade. No, uh, I dated her best friend, and then I actually heard and I, I liked like each her. other. Her I best, think she's cute. Her best friend was a, a bitch. But she's got a twin sister that was awesome. Well, you know what? I got some friends that are pricks. So we'll get along. So get a hold of Dakota's friend and all of us can go have some fun. No, actually, I just figured I'd just talk to Rich and he'd put in a word. And if it doesn't work, you know what? The guy works with her every I day. I can put in a good word for out. you. Terry, I can put in a good word for you. I'm I still just, good friends with her. Hey, you know what? I don't know if if we're even compatible, if we're even acceptable. I can, you know I, I can say some nice things. I can't. 
get a response out of her on Facebook anymore. My son because works, she's not on there all the time. No, nah, my son. Now nah, she bought that house. She's busy as hell, and my son works with her, and says she's just super girl. And I said, well, yeah. "Did you tell her who I am?" Oh yeah, she knows who you are, Dad. She, you know, she, she sees your boat and the parades and everything else. And I said, "Well, why won't she talk?" She, Dad, how far do you want me to go with this? I just work with her at the country club. I said, I can't get personal with her. She doesn't um, drink with all of them. She's not part of that crowd. Natalie is her own person, always has been. But you know what? Okay, now you get a rule of something here. This is between me and you. I'm home seven, eight days a month. A month. There's absolutely no way that I could put personally put myself in an obligational argumental state with anybody when you only see him four days five days sure a month. you could you're Terry <laughs> yeah I could be accused of lot lizards um, you know but see I don't want that I want somebody that Terry you're a good guy I want somebody that is self-sustained somebody I'm going to tell you what. You know the problem is? We I'm know all these Quincy that. girls, and we need to go to I'm another town. Back. I'm getting back in the truck. What we need to do is we need to Here's, start hanging out in Hannibal and getting no. some Missouri chicks. No. because or Iowa chicks. No, getting laid is No, no I didn't say light. I said we got to go get us some. It's easy. Because I can be a man. Quincy, Quincy has the, the chicks that think they are on top of the world. They're not. Dude, I fuck. I mean, I haven't I mean, I've been I screwed even, over by two I don't even. I don't even do that. I spend my 25, 30 bucks a month, and I go on dating sites. Um, <laughs> I'm no, really. I'm on Plenty of Fish. 30, <laughs> 30 bucks a month. You don't got to. Just go to Plenty of Fish, buddy. No, I just go 30 bucks a month. Why do you got to pay anything when you site? get the main ones free? Because Plenty I'm not fish. looking for a piece of ass. I didn't say you're looking for a piece of ass. Go to PlentyofFish.com. Plenty of Fish. No, actually, I went to uh, the site that was 45 and over. No, go to plenty of fish. Forty-five and, and over. Trust me. Will you trust me? Don't go to my phone and do that. I can't even do it. I'm gonna send it. To uh, you. no, really, seriously. Between me and you, I uh. You're gonna see this tomorrow and be like, "What's this?" And you're gonna go to it. I want you to fill it no, up. No, no. Yes, because, because I'm, I'm on it and you bitch. And there's a lot of great people on there. Nice people. I don't want to get laid. I didn't say that. I said there's a lot of nice people. I didn't say nothing about getting laid. Did I say anything about getting laid? All right. Let's talk about this another time. Uh-oh. Did Gina go and send something to me? Come, you won't come inside, so... Because i got to go home and get some sleep, last man. Last time you came inside... Yeah, last call. time, you know what? I don't get out of here for hours. All of a sudden, it's going to be a daylight. No, I'm going to call... We're going we're gonna to call... Uh, we're all right. Where's my phone? You just had it on you. You took my phone. No, I didn't. I do not... Right there in your hands, dumb, dumb dumbass. It's in your left hand. Shut up. That was just funny. Let's go in and call uh, Doyle. Dude, I, gotta go, I gotta go home and go to bed. Guy. You go call him. We talk until like 2 in the morning. Go home. I'm sending you this this thing. That's nah, fine. Plenty. You know, uh, Karen, Karen's a nice girl. And uh, maybe maybe it'll work out. Maybe it won't. Yeah, and if you can get a double date going, then we're more comfortable on double dates. Well, do you want to go with Dakota? Yep. Really? Yeah, why not? She looks a little rough for me. But she's perfect for me, man. I like the rough. I don't know. You you like that kind of shit? Huh? No, really. She looked a little like... I like that stuff. She fucking wearing my ass out in bed. Yeah, not me, though. No, I want the one that's more little... Seductive that's why I said I'll take the Cody, you take the other one. Really? Yep. You, you're into that? Yeah. But Crazy you know, freak might, yellow. That might be uh, a little bit something we can work out if... Uh, <laughs> Karen uh, contacts me back and uh, said, well, I got somebody who really like to see Dakota again. And she goes, oh, really? You know, something like that. And I go, well, I mean, I don't want to throw you into her, but if, if she contacts me back and said, well, I got a buddy of mine. I said, he was with us that night. I said, well, you really think she's hot? And no, if I do that, I mean, don't let me down. Don't. I don't I'm going to throw you out there if, if you're willing to fight. I'm willing to bite. All right. All right. I'll see you later. Cool. I'll see you tomorrow. Call me when you wake up. Yeah. 
Not before nine o'clock. No, go get some sleep, all right? No, sleep right. Shit, yeah, I got another bottle inside. Oh, my God. See ya. See ya later. <laughs>